This is Breakfast Daily on City TV. We are still in the nutrition kind of mood, you know. And just in case you are not doing the turkey berries and the garden eggs and you want something a bit exotic, we are going to be telling you what you can't do. This is the cooking segment and we have here with us Chef Abram Agbuz and he's doing something beautiful. Welcome to Breakfast Daily, Chef. Yes, madam. Good morning. Good morning. So what are you preparing for us uh, today? Please, I take today. We're preparing a uh, shrimp avocado wrap. Mm. No, it, lo it looks very, what, from what I'm seeing, it looks like it's going to be a very healthy meal. Yes, please. Awesome. So take us through the stuff you have here. Oh, okay. Yeah, when you check here, we have a tortilla wrap, we have a fresh tomatoes, an avocado, a lemon juice, and then we have a lettuce. Mm -hmm. We have cream cheese to spread, to spread on the tortilla wrap. Okay. We have some honey there. We have some... Uh, uh, could you uh, mustard mm. dressing over there okay. to mix with the shrimps, shrimps before okay. we wrap? Okay, now you are chopping tomatoes already. Yes, please. Okay, so we are ready. But what is this? Uh, this is cream cheese, the remaining one. Oh, okay, so I, I have already mixed it. Already. Ah, yeah. okay. Now, how long will it take to prepare uh, this? This is about five minutes. Oh, fast? Yeah, it's even less than five minutes. Awesome. To get it done. Great. So the shrimps is already steamed? Yes, please. And okay. then shrimp, you can steam it, boil no, water. Let's be going on because we want to eat yeah. before we go. You boil water and then you put your shrimp inside. Okay. Oh, when so the water you don't is have to cook it? No, no, no. You don't have to ah. cook it. You have to boil the water first. Okay. Before you add the shrimp to it. Or if you like, uh, you can steam the water with your spices. Okay. When okay. it's being boiled, uh -huh. then you add the shrimp to it. But oh. the shrimp is... In, it doesn't have that much of heavy stuff, mm, so, you don't so need to do yeah, you don't need to cook it, overcooked in. Right. You know, you, you will not get the nutrition from I get whatever you. you want it. Awesome. Okay. Can I help you with something? You uh, okay? Okay, I'm okay now. So I think we can wrap two at the same time. Yeah, why not? So in this case, mm -hmm. I will spread my cream cheese, cheese yeah. on the tortilla wrap. Is there a specific cheese we should be looking out for when we get to uh, the supermarket? Mostly we use cream cheese. Okay. Or if you want to use any salad the dressing, cheese, yeah. Uh, feta cheese will give you salted taste mm. because the cheese is almost toss, salted or, 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 already. already. Yeah. yeah. So therefore, you have to use either mayonnaise or okay. any salad dressing which you like it. Mm. to spread mm. on the bread before but you, you can add use cheddar cheese too uh, cheddar cheese you know cheddar cheese mostly or less it's been heat mm -hmm. before it, it comes it is, is a bit yeah solid okay but you need something soft that you can spread across yes please awesome okay yes, please. but cream cheese is not difficult to find yes please okay so as we are done now mm -hmm. we'll mix the shrimp with the mustard dressing okay before we add it to mm. our main wrap okay so we just add some small to it mm -hmm. can you use any other um spice you know to marinate yeah, yeah, it yeah. according to what you want yeah according to what you want or what to make your taste flavor for you yeah that's what you use cool but as for this what you are using is a mustard dressing okay so from there, you add your lettuce mm -hmm. on the wrap. Okay. The bread, we call it bread. The tortilla bread. Yeah, the tortilla bread. So from there, add your... But can you use the normal Lebanese bread too? Mm. Or it has to be tortilla, just so no, it, the no. wrapping will be easier? Yeah, so that with this one, it makes the wrap here easier for you. Yeah, it won't break. Yeah, it won't break. Mm. So that you got whatever you want from inside. Yeah. So after spreading your tomatoes, mm -hmm. uh, you need to cut your avocado too. Okay. It has to be very soft avocado. It has to be very soft avocado, yes. Okay. Mm. So. It has to be penkun. You know penkun? Penkun, yeah, the local okay. one. <laughs> yeah, so this is penkun. Yes, please. Uh huh. Penkun is nicer. So just use your, your spoon. To scoop it off. To scoop it off. Okay. It's nice. But how long have you been a chef? Mm, about 10 years now. Oh, wow. Yes. Interesting. Ten years now. Started from the grass uh -huh. and now and to now the grease. And now you are guard at Yes. <laughs> nice. All right, so you're coming from Dana's Chef School. Yes, please. Okay, so can I contract you to like do stuff for me? 
Oh yeah, you can call. Okay. You can call. Are you very expensive? Oh, not that much. Oh, it depends on what I'm cooking. Yes, please. Hey. Mami, I like exotic stuff. <laughs> <laughs> the pocket. Now you heard yeah. the conversation about trying to live healthy. Yeah. I mean, so now looking at your pocket. Okay. Yeah, we add our shrimp to it. Ah. If you like, after adding your shrimp. Yeah. If that is mine, I like a lot of shrimps. Oh, okay. It's because of the size of the bread. Okay, so you can't so, add too yeah, much. We can't add too much. But if it's coming up, I'll hold it with my hand. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah. So from there, if you like, you can season it again uh -huh. with white pepper. Oh, okay. White pepper, just a little bit to make it mm. tastier. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then salt. Okay. I've salt there. Mm. It looks good. Yeah. So for me, I like honey mm -hmm. to make it a little bit solid. When I bite it, I got the mm. sweetness. Tasty. Interesting. Yeah. I would never think of adding honey to something like this. Yeah. Well, that is why you are the chef. Yeah. Okay. So what can you eat this with? Ah, uh, you can eat this with, with your fresh blended uh, uh, fruits. Fruit juice. Fruit juice. Okay. If you like. But tea? As tea, you can take it with okay. tea. Because this is a little bit uh, heavier before breakfast. Uh -huh. You can take it as a breakfast yes. before anything. Mm. As you take your mm -hmm. your coffee or anything, you know. okay. Yes, so just oh, to seal it. it to seal it okay. with the creamy cheese before, ah. so that it doesn't open. Yeah. So we have one now. Mm -hmm. It looks good. Yeah. I mean, this can be an easy um, lunch pack. Yeah, you know, easy as way. well. Yeah, easy, easy. Wow. So when we want to contact you, how do we get in touch with you? Ah, okay. You can contact the school. Okay, Danish Chef School. Danish Chef School. Okay. Which is uh, the number 055-067-2222. Zero five five zero six seven. Six seven six nine. Are you sure? It looks like you're not sure. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm okay. very sure. Yeah. Oh, oh, That's oh, a let's, zero, let's, okay. Zero, zero five five, uh -huh. zero six seven, uh -huh. and then seven na six nine. That's okay. the school's number. Mm. And also, if you needed me directly, yeah, you can also call zero five four seven four nine six eight seven six. Awesome. Can we find yeah. it on social media? Our social media is Danny Chef School. Okay. Uh, on uh, on the Facebook Danny Chef School. Mm -hmm on instagram then chef school great yeah. this looks good and um even without tasting i can tell that it's very yeah. nutritious and it will be very tasty abram thank you very much so thank the next too. thing we're going to be doing is just be tasting but you can tell that it already uh, will be something that tastes really really good this is breakfast daily we'll be right back